my beauty babes it is your girl ceo queendom back again for another video this time you guys is going to be a story time and as y'all can see your girl has done her makeup yet again for another story time y'all i don't know why i keep doing my makeup for a story time but that's not even the purpose okay so i want to tell y'all this story time of when i went to the bus stop to get ready to go to work and this dude in a wheelchair was acting a plum fool like a plum fool okay so boom this is how i start i normally get on the bus or if i want to shop because i used to work for dds if i want to shop i would normally ride the bus like an hour before i would have to be there so that i could shop a little bit and still be in the area so i won't be late so i get up get myself dressed i head out the door I walked to the bus stop. As I'm walking across the, because it got like a busy intersection in, um, across from the bus stop. So, as I'm walking across the intersection, y'all, no lie, no bullshit. Excuse my French, but I'm going to cuss on this video. No bullshit. I look down and wonder why it's traffic. It was like two or three cars. There's a stoplight, but where the rest of the cars? Because this intersection always busy. So, I look down. Y'all, this man is in a whole wheelchair, and he is stopping traffic. It, he is stopping traffic, and he's talking, hey, hey, hey. Now, <laughs> I'm walking across the street, and I'm like, I know he ain't talking to me. I know he's not talking to me. I know he's not talking to me. I know he's not talking to me. So, he says, hey, hey. So, I just walk to the bus stop, y'all. Sit my sit down. In my mind, I'm like, ooh, this man ain't going to come over here. He ain't going to want to talk to me. Da, 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 da. The lies I said. The lies I said. Sis, the lies. So he come up to the bus stop after he stopped stopping traffic. He comes and say, hey, you got a cigarette? I said, no, nah, I don't smoke cigarettes or whatever. I don't smoke. And he said... Oh, man. Well, let me see if somebody got a cigarette. Now, mind y'all, after he didn't got out the way, he come out with the traffic coming up. It's the red light. So, he goes to people's cars, y'all. And this man said out of his mouth, You got a cigarette? You got a cigarette? I suck your dick for a cigarette. I suck your dick for a cigarette. And I was like, Does this man just say he'll suck? somebody's dick for a cigarette and i was like what like it it, it baffled me because look y'all i'm mind frame i'm finna get on the bus like i normally do catch this bus all the time i'm finna get on this bus and it's gonna be a regular ride i don't know what was set up for me that day that i had to encounter this crazy man in a fucking wheelchair so he just started going around knocking on people's windows, man. Just knocking on people's fucking windows. Like, hey, you got, you got a cigarette. And I'm sitting there like, what in the world? So I'm like, you know what? Forget this. I'm finna start recording. So when he first started out, I'm like, I'm just baffled. You know, I'm baffled at the stuff that's coming out of this man's mouth. So I pull out my extra camera right and i start recording on the other phone now in the video i'm going to drop the clips in this video you guys in the video you guys you can hear me on the phone and when i'm on the phone i'm talking to my husband and i'm telling my husband oh i wish you could see this oh i wish you could see this like i was that freaking stunned that this man was doing this so mind you i'm sitting there i'm just laughing giggling laughing giggling so then he sits in his wheelchair, y'all, and he started dancing and waving his towel and twerking and stuff, y'all, right? So I'm like, what in the world? Why in the hell is this happening while I'm at the bus stop? This don't normally happen. Why? Why me? Why? Why, Why me? Right? So I'm sitting there like, okay, cool. I'm just not going to pay attention to him. Lies. This man kept doing the darnest shit. Seriously. You guys, he jumped out the fucking wheelchair and started twerking on the ground. Twerking on the ground. 
He was twerking, listening to his song. He was talking about blood this and blood that and blood this and blood that. And I'm like, where's this bus at? This bus needs to come on. <laughs> These spirits, I can't do it. Like, I'm ready to go. Like, to work. Like, right now, I'm ready to be anywhere but at that goddamn bus stop. Because that man was doing too much. Yeah, he was twerking and twerking and twerking instead of telling people, Do you like cigarettes? You like cigarettes? I suck yo. I suck yo. I'm like, Y'all, why? What did I do? What did I do to deserve that? That's that's not even the kicker. This part I did not catch on camera, y'all, because I was at a certain time period, I was getting irritated. And I'm going to insert that clip as well. When I start getting irritated. Okay. So then I'm like, okay, cool. We get on the bus. He gets on the bus as well. So I sit in the back of the bus so he would stop talking to me. Okay. So we sitting on the bus or whatever, whatever. He gets off the bus, right? We at a light. And there's an intersection. Okay. Cars go this way. Cars go back and forth. This man got off of the bus. And roll straight into traffic. Straight into tra traffic is going. This man is rolling straight into traffic. And I'm sitting there like, okay, see, this man had to been on some type of drugs, y'all. On some type of drugs. And then he on the phone. While he on the phone, he was saying his mama was a bee and uh, she was trying to steal his money and all kinds of stuff. And I'm sitting there like, what kind of, fa what, what is going on in your life? You ain't even my friend. What's going on in, in your life that you talking about your mama on the phone? Then he start, then he start talking about, uh, he met a black dude. I don't know if he said in jail or something like that. And he had some good. And I'm like, bro, why is this man saying all this stuff around me? Like, what did I do to deserve this buffoonery and foolishness? Because I was over it. But, baby, when he started having conversations about what he was doing to that black man, I was like, oh, pick me, pick me. I'm ready to go. Somebody come get me because I cannot handle this. I can't handle this. Y'all, when that man got off that bus, I was scared that he rolled into traffic. Because I don't want nobody to get hurt. And that's on big period, point blank, and periods. And more periods. But I was so happy that this man got off that bus. Because he was on the bus saying the same stuff on the bus. And I'm like, I know this bus driver want to throw him off the bus. I know this bus driver want to throw him off the bus. Y'all, that situation messed me up so bad that I didn't want to ride the bus the next day because I was scared he was going to be at the bus stop. Like, I didn't want to run into this man ever, ever, ever again because this stuff that he was doing on the ground, y'all, he had no legs. Let me tell y'all. <laughs> and I have nothing against handicapped people. I love handicapped people, okay? But let me tell y'all something. This man had... Three fingers on this hand. Three fingers on this hand. He was holding a cell phone. He had no legs. Sis, he had no legs. But he was twerking on the ground. How? How sway? Hell. Hell. Why me? This, I just, I just, you know, I had a conversation with God later. Y'all need to hear that. Y'all need to see that. I just want to know why me. Why that day? Like, why you couldn't have came and rode the bus like two hours after? Maybe maybe it was my fault. I'm going to tell y'all why it's my fault. My bus shouldn't have been trying to get on that bus to go ride for an hour early to go shop. It was my fault, partially. Had I rode the bus when I was supposed to, I probably wouldn't have seen him. Hmm. Now that I think about it, child, I'm glad that's over. I ain't never got to see him again. Whew. Thank you, Jesus. Well, you guys, that is the end of my story time of the man with no legs that was twerking on the ground. And he was a blood.
point blank period so until next time you guys if you have not subscribed make sure to subscribe you guys join the the beauty beauty bandits you know what i'm saying join us join join the beauty 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 that's all i talk about beauty love all that so join us make sure to like this video you guys drop a comment down below and also turn on your notification bell period sis because you need to know when this heat coming and that's all <laughs> big period so until next time bye <laughs>